Coach Chandler here. Today we are going to work on our overhand throw so that we can throw the ball really far to our friends when we are playing. So today for equipment, what you are going to need is a ball of any size. If you don't have a ball, you can take a pair of socks like this. Sorry, they're a little tangled. And you're just going to roll them up into a nice little ball. So you have a ball. This is a good idea if you're playing inside so you don't break anything. And you'll need something that you can kind of throw your balls into. I'm going to use this green bucket, but you can use a laundry basket. You can use a hula hoop, whatever you have around the house. So let's get started. So when we are throwing a ball, there are three keywords we need to remember. T, step, throw. It's going to look like this. T, step, and then throw. Let's practice that three times without a ball. Ready? Do it with me. T, step, and throw. There's one. Let's do it two more times. T, step, and throw. Last time. T, step, and throw. Now we need to set up for what we're going to do. So you're going to need to grab your basket and your ball, or balls, depending on how many you have. And you want to put the basket a little bit in front. And then step back to where your balls are. Let's practice. Grab your ball. Okay, let's get ready to throw our ball. So you're gonna take your basket, put it off to the side, and then step back a little. Okay guys, let's practice our throw. Here we go. T, step, throw. Okay guys, so remember, when we are throwing the ball, we have three key words. T, step, and throw. When you are at home, maybe try to grab a brother, a sister, a mom and dad, or maybe a friend and practice throwing. I am gonna practice throwing with my friend. Here we go. T, step, throw. Come back next week and get ready to soar with playing. Bye.